We're on scene of a major emergency structure fire in South Los Angeles. We arrived on scene to find a two-story vacant commercial building with fire showing from the roof. Firefighters immediately initiated an offensive operation, forcing entry into the building while truck companies went to the roof to conduct vertical ventilation operation. The fire quickly extended into the attached unit. But due to the heavy fire on both floors and a compartmentalized interior, including a subterranean floor, we had difficulty accessing the seat of the fire. Additionally, the structural integrity of one side of the building came into question. Therefore, we transitioned into a defensive operation by pulling firefighters out from the interior and off the roof to pour water from large hose lines from the outside. Then we had a significant partial building collapse. While continuing to battle the large flames, the focus then shifted to defending the exposed three-story commercial building just a few feet away. A coordinated attack by 160 firefighters led by Assistant Chief Katie Kepner resulted in an extinguishment of the fire at the 90-minute mark. One firefighter was transported early into the incident for non-life-threatening injuries, and the LAFD arson section responded for the cause investigation per protocol for a major emergency incident.